All right, hey guys, this is Tiamat Ruler, and this is just going to be a little update video plus some thank yous, kind of like my welcome to my channel video. But um, to start off, I want to let you know that I'm sorry for not getting my Oros episode or my Oros series up like right away, like I was planning. I even said that in my last episode of my Hexlock that I would do that, but. I was not able to, and there, are, I mean, the main reason behind that is because the, my friend who does my graphics for me, because I am not really skilled in that sort of, in that area of, for YouTube, I have a friend who does it for me, and he did not get those, he was not able to get those graphics to me, because he had medical reasons. I mean, his name is Hydro, his Twitter, or his YouTube and Twitter are Hydros Plays, but he just was not able to get those graphics to me on time and you know graphics are a big part especially with pokemon videos graphics are a big part of them and i can't just put out the series without the graphics so what i've been doing right now is i'm playing through oros casually on my own it's still a wonderlock but i'm doing it on my own and the main reason for that is because i am i need to finish the game at least once to get something for one of the series I was going to do for Oros. I'm not going to tell you what the series is right now because you'll find out when it comes out. I've been doing other stuff for it to plan for it. I've been, I mean, some of you may know because you've been watching me do it, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to say it right out, out loud because it'll, it's kind of supposed to be a surprise. Some people know what it is. Some people don't, but I have the graphics for one of the series. Now he's going to be working on the other, and there are some other things I need for the other series. The first one of the series I'm going to be doing is an Omega Ruby, um, an Omega Ruby Wonderlock, and I know a lot of people are doing Wonderlocks, but I've never done a Wonderlock before. Um, I didn't really want to do X and Y because it was so popular, but I mean I have Oros out. It's a new game, and I've been planning these series for a while now, so I'm not just going to stop them just because everybody's doing it. Um, I've been planning them for a while now, um, but. That's what that's one of the series I'm going to be doing is an Alf is an Omega Ruby Wonderlock. Now there are some stipulations I'm probably going to put on that because you don't get the Wonder Trading available until after you get you get it from Wally after you help him catch his first Pokemon, which is already pretty far into the. I mean, it's not too far, but it's already pretty far where your po your starter. I mean, it's, I have to use someone to beat all these trainers, and my starter's probably going to be like level 13 or something by then. So, because I'm not going to use anybody else, because I don't want to, I'm going to wonder trade him off. So I'm probably just going to keep my starter in that. Um, let me know if you think that's a good idea or not. The other series is going to be an Alpha Sapphire run. It's not going to be a, a Nuzlocke, although it would be fun to be a Nuzlocke with what it is, but it's not going to be a Nuzlocke. Um... And what I will let you know is it has to do with the Oros Megas. Um, those are the only Pokemon I'm going to be using is Oros Megas, but I'm not going to tell you anything specific. Some of you may already guess based on what you've seen me doing, but that's all I'm going to tell you right now. What I need to know is do you want to see the Wonderlock first, or the Omega Ruby Wonderlock first, or the other series, and find out what it is. Because I still need the, lay the layout and the gra I need the graphics for the Alpha Sapphire run. But, I mean, and I still want you guys to let me know what you want first. Um, I may do them kind of at the same time, eventually, like start one later on while I'm halfway through the other, or something like that. Um, but... If you do want me to do the Alpha Sapphire one first, then I do have to wait a bit to get everything I need for it. So, um, there is that. Now, those are my plans right now. Those are the two series I'm going to do. I may start doing um, my Shiny Hunting streams in Oros from now on. I may start doing my Random Wonder Trades and Wonder, Lock, or Wonder Cups in Oros from now on, especially since I have a game that I've already played through. I do have, I mean, just to show you, um, I do have... Both of these games, I mean, that I haven't opened yet. So, I mean, I don't know if you can even tell that they're not opened yet, but they're not opened yet. So, these are set aside specifically to play for you guys. So, I have my own that I downloaded on my game that I'm playing myself. For myself. Aside from that, the thank yous. 
Um, this, this is just, um, if you're wondering, I'm about to get ready for work. I just wanted to get this done and get this up before I go to work because I found it to be important. But thank yous. First of all, thank you to all of you for supporting me through the two series that I've completed so far. The um, Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke and the Platinum Randomizer Hexlock. Um, I did end up, if you haven't seen it by now, I'm going to give spoilers, so don't, if you don't, don't watch this part. If you skip ahead a few minutes or a few seconds or whatever, if you don't want to listen to this. But I did complete the Platinum Randomizer Hexlock without losing any Pokemon, which I think is a very good feat. I had some people tell me I couldn't do it. Um, they, cha they uh, sorry, they challenged me, which is why I, one of the reasons why I wanted to do it. I wanted to do a Hexlock anyways when Dragon Tamer Blade did it to begin with, but, um, but the other part is because people, I mean, I, some friends of mine didn't, weren't able to complete it, and so I did it. But thank you for staying with me through those and supporting me through those, um, I really appreciate it. I definitely really appreciate that. Now, some very specific thank yous. Very first off, um, a wild chikorita. I call her Taylor or Tay. Uh, most of you know her as, as Tay, probably. Um, but she is she is going to be changing to Amazing Tay. That's going to be her new YouTube name. But um, just most of you probably who are subscribed to me know her as a wild chikorita. But Big thank you to her. She is like my one of my best friends, probably my best friend at this point. Um, and she she just supported me all the way through. I've supported her all the way through. We talk every almost every single day, unless we just one of us just doesn't have time. But we go to we go to each other for everything pretty much. Um, and I mean, she she said in her update video that she probably wouldn't be on YouTube without me. I probably wouldn't be on YouTube anymore without her. She has been a big support, a big help, um, and she, she is one of my greatest friends. Um, probably my best friend. And um, I love her to death. She is amazing. You go check her out. And I do want to thank you for getting her to a, a thousand subscribers because and, and beyond because she well deserves all of that support and and way more. She is amazing. She may not believe it herself, but she is absolutely amazing. And I mean, that's what I have to say about her. She is, I mean, there's no other words to describe her. She is amazing. She deserves a lot more support than she gets, but I definitely, I thank you all for supporting her, getting to her 1,000 subscribers. I know a lot of it is because Tamashi's shout out to her. But even so, still, thank you very much for going and supporting her, if you have. And if you haven't, then definitely go check her out. Her link is always in my description because she is one of my best friends. Um, at this point, I don't know if the Johto Trio is going to be a thing. There were some... I'm not going to go into specifics, but um, it's kind of put on hold at this point. We don't know what's going to go going to happen with it, really. But at this point, it's probably not going to be a thing. Which is unfortunate. I was It's kind of like my baby. I was really excited about it. And, I mean... A wild Chikorita Taylor and Hydra's plays John are two, my, two of my my two best friends from YouTube, and they're pretty much my two best friends now out of all my friends, even not out of YouTube. Um, and it's kind of disappointing that it's probably not going to be a thing, but we tried, and I think we just rushed it, unfortunately. But uh, that stuff happens, and we're just going to move on. If it succeeds later on, then it succeeds later on. But if it doesn't, then Maybe I'll be a, maybe I'll succeed in another group channel eventually. Um, I really like the idea of the Jodo Trio, but we'll just we'll just move on from it for now, and focus on my own channel, which is I think is a good idea, anyways. Um, but definitely go support her. She is amazing. That she's my biggest shout out right now because I I love her to death, and she got hit, she hit one K recently, and that's amazing. And her support her her, her support is like. Her getting support is more important to me than me getting support because she is my best friend. So, the other shout out and the next shout out is to Hydro's Plays because he always does my graphics for me. Sometimes he has issues because he has medical issues. I'm not going to go into specifics about that. That's for, not for me to talk about. But I mean, I hate that I have to rely on someone for graphics. But when he doesn't have medical issues, he is usually on the ball, getting them to me as soon as I ask for them. 
um, within a couple days or if they're thumbnails within the day, the next day, or, or not the next day, within the like a couple's hours at most, usually within a couple minutes. So he is amazing at what he does and he has always supported me since I met him. Um, and you should definitely go check him out. His link is always in my description as well. Um, yeah, just please go check him out. He definitely, he's going through some rough times right now. He definitely needs some support. So go check him out, please. Um, the next shout out is to all of the Fab Five. Some of them I've had some, a little bit of falling out with, and I don't agree with some of the things they do, but I'm not going to go into specifics with that as well, because that's not for me to talk, that's not something I need to talk about on YouTube. It's not something I need to talk about in a video, but no matter what any of them have done that I disagree with, they are the reason I am on YouTube. They inspired me to be on YouTube, and so, I mean, the biggest ones right now that I am I still talk with and I still support and they still support me and all that. Galactic Elliot, he's amazing. I go for him. To, I go to him for anything I need. If I have an issue with anybody or anything, I can just go talk to him. And he doesn't spread it around. He's amazing for that. And he he has always supported me from the very beginning. I asked him to check out my Wonder Cup video or my Wonder Trade videos from the very beginning, and he checked them out when I was recording them with my phone. And he checked them out and he said they are great. The only issue is that you're recording them with your phone, so if you get a capture card, perfect. So I kind of stopped doing those for a while because I didn't have a capture card, and I started doing a, my Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke, and I got a capture card, I started doing them again. Um, they're not the greatest for support, but they're okay. But um, he, he definitely supports me from the very beginning. Then there's the 4th Gen Gamer, who has also supported me from the very beginning. They both kind of started supporting me at the same time. The 4th Gen Gamer even made me graphics right away. Uh, not right away, but he, like, when I asked for them, he made, I mean, I had to pay for them, but he made them for me, like, right away. I got them in, like, a week, um, and I was extremely excited. Um, I got new, fresh graphics for my stuff, and they've, they've all approved since I met them, and it's amazing to see all their growth, um, but go support those two especially. Um, Old School Sin has always supported me, um, even though we've had some issues, too. Um, he's always supported me. He's always tr at least tried to support me anyways. I always try to support him when I can. Um, just go check him out. Those are the main three that I that I get along, that I talk to and stuff. Um, but the Fab Five are the reason I'm here because they are the ones, the whole group, inspired me to be on YouTube. So go check them out. That's why I'm here. So, And then there's Dragon Tamer Blade because he inspired me as well. He wasn't as big of an as inspiration as the Fab Five, but he inspired me as well. Go check him out. I I don't think he's putting up videos as much as he used to be, but I, I haven't been watching YouTube as much as I should. I'm sorry, I just haven't had time. But Dragon Tamer Blade, he supported me as well. I mean, he was able to, he was willing to answer questions that I had about YouTube right away when I was starting out because I just, I asked him if I could add him on Skype, and I, he did, and I started asking him questions, and he helped me out. Um, I don't talk to him much as mo as much as mo anymore, but. He still helped me out in the beginning, and he in he also definitely inspired my Hexlock series because he's the one who came up with the Hexlock um, variant, and without him coming up with it, I wouldn't have done it. So that's that's a big deal. Go check him out. Um, as far as other people who have supported me throughout my whole YouTube career pretty much so far, um, there is... Uh, Killerder Zero, also known as Yassin. That's his name. He is German. He is. He has always supported me. He has gifted me a ton of shinies, and I can't. I can't thank him enough for all the support he's given me. He's always there for me if I need to talk to him as well, and he's. He's just always been a great supporter from the very beginning. And all I did was he asked if on one of JPP's videos if I needed a, if someone needed a Tepig. I said I needed a Tepig, and he traded me a Tepig, and we've talked ever since. He checked out my videos, and he loved them. So he's been a supporter ever since. Um, I, he doesn't really put up videos, really. He does, but they're not really, like, Let's Plays or anything like that. I don't even understand what they are, to be honest. But go check him out if you like what he does. If not, just support him on Twitter or things like that. He's a great guy. Um, then there's everybody who's been watching my streams. Like, I can't thank you guys enough at all. 
Like seriously, you guys are amazing. Last stream that I did for a, it was like a 30 plus hour stream. Oh my God, there were some very big issues through it. Uh, I even got really upset and was like, I had a huge like upset little fit. I don't know what you call, it's not really a tantrum, tamper tantrum. It's just, I was upset and I was about to stop the stream and I didn't want to, but I, I just had some issues. If you watch the st which stream when I put it up, you'll understand, you'll see what it is, but they supported me throughout all of it. I mean, you won't see like the comments or anything like that, that went into the discussion, but you'll hear what I was talking about. And I mean, they supported me through all of it. They supported me. The people who were watching my chant, my stream at the time when it happened, they were supporting me throughout the whole thing. And I can't thank you guys enough. I don't have name specifics because I'm not that great with names when I just meet you. Most of you I had met that night and you still supported me. So Twitch followers, I absolutely love you guys. Um, thank you so much for what you did for me that night. I can't, I can't thank you enough. Um, but those are pretty much all my thank yous for now. If I forget anybody, I'm sorry. Um, I'm just, I'm trying to hurry up here. I need to get to work and I need to be at work in 15 minutes. So I need to get this done, but I just, I just needed to get those thank yous out there and I needed to update you on what was going on because I haven't put up a video for quite a while now. Um, it's been about four days or something like that, whatever it is, but yeah, I just need to get that out there. So, I mean... Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate the support, and I definitely thank you guys for going and supporting uh, Taylor, a wild chikorita, or a Majin Tay, whatever. However, you know her as. Thank you for supporting her because I really appreciate it. She deserves it all and more. So, this is me going to be signing out, and I will see you in my next, in my first Aura series, whichever you guys you pref which whichever one you guys prefer. Um, if, you, if I don't get any votes, I'll probably just do the Wonderlock first because I have the graphics for it. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to end this off now because I'm running out of time. But thank you guys so much. And, yeah, I'll see you guys then. This is Tiamat Ruler signing out. And I will see you in the first Aura series. Peace, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.